I love this beat, you cats. This is good. John Goodman is well named. You know, I, one of the things I love about this country is the way we we have these these characters like Paul Bunyan and uh, Johnny Appleseed. You know, we have a character that goes around and plants trees, and we have a character that goes around and cuts them down. You know, and we have these football players like Johnny Unitas and Joe Montana that these names that sound like what they are, you know, mythical names. You know, so John Goodman, you know, if one needs an actor to play a man, he is a good one to do it. He is, in fact, a great one to do it. He is that rare actor who does what he does so effortlessly and so generously that you don't think you're looking at an actor at all. You think the filmmakers went out and found a character to play himself. Gail Snotes in Raising Arizona, Walter Sobchak in The Big Lebowski, Big Dan Teague in Oh Brother Where Art Thou, Charlie Meadows and Barton Fink, and maybe the trippiest of them all, the great Roland Turner in Inside Lewin Davis. These characters are all disturbing, terrifying, and deeply comedic. <laughs> and these are just the films with the Coens. Everyone is an indelible character, everyone mythical. I think of Walter Sobchak casting Donnie's ashes to the wind, standing like Odysseus on a cliff overlooking the ocean. <clears throat> Joel and Ethan are here tonight. Oh, please say hello to Joel and Ethan. Joel and Ethan Cohen. And you know, this isn't even getting to all his extraordinary work on television. Roseanne and West Wing, Treme and Linda Tripp, you know. <clears throat> But we shouldn't just list his obvious accomplishments here. He's profoundly deserving of this honor. 